So, my babies, I was interrupted in the middle of y'all reading. So, I hope y'all don't mind. A lot of this was already spread it. Damn. I, we, I'm just going to take it from the top, and we're going to start all over again. Hi, my 2020 twins. Welcome to Little Twins. Here <laughs> I'm telling you, young, I just don't know. I be trying to live. They just won't let the girl. Okay? So, Jim, I feel like there's someone in the background trying to see some sort of revenge or win, lose, or draw. This motherfucker's trying to draw you out. Okay? Somebody is now feeling a very intense connection. This motherfucker feels triggered. Okay? This motherfucker is mad because you out here being happy, okay? I don't know. Take the rest, take the story, how it resonates. If it's not you, it's not you. It's the other person, it's the other person, whatever, okay? But some motherfucking body is suffering in silence, and the waiting game has begun, okay? Your third eye chakra needs to be activated, and you need to be on point. You need to be really standing in your high priestess or high priest mode because of some shit going on around you at this time that you may not be necessarily aware of. Or you could be, because you know us. We, we normally want our shit. You know what I'm saying? But look at this. Somebody's upset and suffering in silence because you, you ended a cycle, okay? You ended a cycle. You're working on yourself. You're healing. You're doing what you need to do for you. Now, look at this here. We have a well-deserved reward, and we have balance. This balance right here, I feel like this is you, you know, feeling at peace. You feel, you, you realize you have everything you need in order for you to manifest and get to the top of whatever your endeavor is or whatever it is that you're trying to do. For some of you, you could have a dream could have came true. You could have purchased your dream home. You could have built your dream home, okay? And I feel like in this time with this rainbow being here, you are protected in this time. Now, we do have, okay, sacrifice and release. So, in order for you to shed a lot of the, the toxicity, the drama, the bullshit, the gaslighting, all of that, like, you're going to have to make these sacrifices and release somebody or something, okay? Now, you got a motherfucker over here. That they're trying to be all up in your fucking business. They mad. Why? Because you out here, bitch. You're manifesting. And everything you're manifesting is coming into fruition. And they're not understanding why the fuck is it happening for the gym. Okay? They're not understanding that shit. They like, okay, wait a minute. What the fuck is she doing? What he doing that I ain't doing? Bitch, I'm doing what? I'm praying. And one of y'all just said, y'all said y'all prayers. I think it was Jen. You said you was doing your prayers. Yeah, baby. You Like I say, you pray. Yeah, see? No insecurities, baby. You're standing in your motherfucking power. There's nothing that a motherfucker can do right now to ruffle your motherfucking feathers. And that's what I'm loving, Jim. You are not. You're in the fucking flow. You're not letting motherfuckers play with you. You're taking the lead of your own motherfucking life, okay? You're not playing these games with these motherfuckers. You're just not doing it. You know what I'm saying? I feel like you've healed those inner childhood wounds. You've been working on yourself. <clears throat> and you, for, for some of you, it's some, it, you know, it's something that you feel like, I feel like spirit is getting ready to bless you guys as well. There could be someone that's getting ready to come into your life, honey, that, you know, in the past, I feel like you was dealing with players who, you know, they fake acting like they got money. They want to fake flaws. They show off all the extra shit. Yeah, you said that's not for me. There was no connection there. You know what I'm saying? There was no no bond, no real connection, nothing mentally, nothing physical. You know, it could have been just physical. For the most part, because whoever this motherfucker is, this motherfucker got more game than the NBA. Okay? Some of you, you could be dealing with a ball player. How you doing? Okay. But if somebody waved the motherfucking white flag and said, I can't do this right here. This ain't for me. Okay. And you're unfazed as fuck. You like, okay, whatever. I'm un you're unfazed. You're not letting anything. There's some you gave somebody a fucking rude awakening. And this motherfucker now is tripping the fuck out on you. Why? Because see, you're winning. You're out here winning. This motherfucker is going through all kinds of shit. And you're celebrating this some more shit. And this person is not understanding why all this great shit is happening for Jim. They're not, they, 
they can't grasp the concept of what is it about Jim that all of this good shit is happening for them, okay? Let's see what, okay, let's see. Yeah, playfulness. I feel like you're just in a very lighthearted mood, and that's what, yes, baby, main attraction. Somebody's falling in love, bitch, I'm trying to tell you. I don't know who this motherfucker is, and whoever it is, I don't feel like they revealed themselves yet. Hold on, y'all, give me one more minute. Give me one second, because, you know, I don't know. You know, mama got to be in, in the court. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay. Yeah, see, you know what I'm saying? It was too much going on with the motherfucking red glasses. I can't do it. Okay, let's get it together. All right, we back in action. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. Yeah, I'm going to play for this. So, yeah, that's what's making you so attractive to everybody. Like, no matter what these motherfuckers try to do, baby, your light keeps shining. Okay. They keep shining, baby. Oh, damn. So see how this motherfucker made this shit? Because, bitch, look, you're still the main attraction, though. <laughs> they made you. Wait a minute. Baby, you got the happiness hater out here and your destiny at all, bitch. You're looking pretty. You're looking pretty. Okay, but didn't I say, bitch, an offer coming in for you? But there could be some motherfucker here who ain't got no motherfucker. Whoever this motherfucker is ain't got no money. Bitch, they pockets is lenty. Okay, not lengthy. Lenty. Okay. This motherfucker ain't got nothing. So whoever this is, somebody making some fake, fake accounts and shit. And they upset because, bitch, look at you. You're out here. You're being an idol and shit. You know what I'm saying? Your motherfuckers are seeing you. They seeing you grow and glow, baby. Didn't I talk about that yesterday? Mm-hmm. They seeing you glow and grow. And the motherfucker is triggered. Okay? <laughs> this motherfucker triggered, but whoever this motherfucker is, they gonna act like they gonna scare you into some shit, into a relationship. Jim say, bitch, I said I don't want you. <laughs> Didn't I tell you that? Uh, Jim say ain't insecure about shit. Look at this, forgiving and healing. Yeah, you don't forgave the shit, but you know, you ain't about to take their ass back. You say, look, I forgive you. See, yeah, somebody get ready to come in, bitch, and give you some butterflies, bitch. Okay? And through all this disharmony and all this bullshit, somebody get ready to come in, baby, and you gonna have butterflies. You give me butterflies. I love my Michael. I miss Michael. Yeah, it's self-love. And this is what's making you this motherfucking main attraction. Bitch, you're focused on yourself, your home, your foundation, bitch. Like I said, you're out here looking good. You're unfazed by these motherfuckers' lips perky. Lips perky, bitch. They look, you got on a good little cute little mauve, you know what I'm saying? Your little, your little blush pink. Okay, solemn gem. <laughs> Wait a minute, Jim. They mad, bitch. They mad. Yeah, so see, somebody ready to come in, bitch, and court you. See, this is the shit that I was talking about. This is what we've been waiting on. A motherfucker who knows what the fuck they see. You see what I'm saying? Not coming over here with the bullshit and all the extra shit. You know what I'm saying? Look at this. Divine union. Baby memories. Something is getting ready to come to you. You remember in a time where, you know, you and someone was very devoted to each other. I feel like you're going to get some exciting news. This could be from a past life type, a past life person. But I feel like somebody is having some serious memories, okay? Happiness haters. Somebody suffering like a motherfucker in silence because you zero that ass out. All right, come on. We're going to get some, some, some messages from Big Baby because then, ooh, yeah, look at this. Yeah, 
somebody mad, bitch, because you turned they ass the fuck down. You said, I am good. I don't need that shit. Yeah. I don't need that shit. So this person could look at you like you think you better than everybody. Because <laughs> if you see him, he's above the crowd, above the crowd, then that say, bitch, you put an end to some shit. This motherfucker's mad as hell because you let they ass go. Ace of Cups in the reverse. Why did you reject this? Ooh, bitch a tower. So I don't know if that, you know, it wasn't built on a firm foundation. For some of you, this could be the STD shit, but I didn't see that come out, so we ain't going there. Okay, we're not about to go there. Give me one more. Ooh, bitch, a queen of wands in the reverse. Mmm. Mm-mm. So we got a side piece or we got a fire sign that this bitch is angry, baby. This bitch angry. Tell me about this here. Let's play it up. Yeah, you move the fuck on, Jim. Say I'm out of here, bitch. <laughs> bitch, I'm in my little Uber boat, my lift. I gotta get the fuck. I ain't got time. Mm mm. You said yeah. Ooh, baby. So, honey, you don't walk. You done moved away from this motherfucker mentally and emotionally. Okay. You said, look, I'm the fuck up out of here. Like I said, you could be on your player shit. You could be out here one of fake flex and shit. Bitch, I'm about to go where I know it's some real shit getting ready to come towards me. So you turned this motherfucker down. You turned it down. Six of swords, eight of cups. You turned it down. You said I don't have time. No, I don't. Six of swords, eight of cups, please. Six of swords, eight of cups. Oh. But this motherfucker, somebody's silent. Okay, wait a minute. That's entirely too many. We ain't doing it like that. Ooh, so judgment in the reverse. <sighs> so, Jim, you walked away, but it's something you still unsure about. We're going to see what the fuck that's about. Okay. Oh, so somebody wants to come in with a slow offer. This is a night. So it could be a young earth sign that's getting ready to come towards you. We have a queen of pentacles. Okay. So you had this little young earth sign getting ready to come towards you. Or they, this is what they're embodying. So this could be someone that's younger than you. But whoever this is, this person is tripping on you. They're trying to figure out how they can make you this fucking offer. Yeah, see? Somebody wants a new contract with you. Now this could be work. But I don't feel like it. Well, yeah, because this is all pentacles right here. So this is about money. So for some of you, for some of you, I feel like work could be a burden at this time. It could be a lot going on. Um, I feel like spirit is saying to, you know, somebody's going to break off from the five of pentacles, bitch, though, to the ten of pentacles. Some of you could be in, then I say, a new home. We got the four wands here. So this could be about, you know, somebody could be getting ready to move. Oh, look at this. Two of cups. Okay. But something is a burden here. And But we have divine time now. All right, let's see what's going on. I don't know why y'all be feeling like I need a bigger table. My son keeps talking about don't get a bigger table. I feel like I need a bigger table. All right, let's see what's going on. So why this Ace of Cups is in the reverse? Ace of Cups reverse in the tower. Uh huh, that motherfucking Aquarius. Ace of Cups in the reverse, the tower. Two of Cups. 
two of coins in the reverse, bitch. You ain't confused about shit. Jim said, bitch, I'm taking a break from your toxic ass. I ain't got time for that shit. Get the fuck on. Yeah, you done figured out this motherfucker toxic as hell. Okay? Yeah, a whole motherfucking fool. <laughs> look, you don't realize this nigga's a whole fool. Okay? And you say, look, bitch, I ain't got time for you and your bullshit. Okay? I'm going to get ready to go take a leap of faith on something else and somewhere else. I don't have time. You are forgiving yourself for putting up with some bullshit. I feel like a lot of you, yeah, look at this. Okay, so you could have a, fire, a feminine fire sign around you that's upset about your money. And this person could be keeping some sort of secret. Yeah, look at this with the five of wands. Didn't I say it's some sort of conflict? So it's some sort of conflict about money. Seven of swords. Hmm. So someone could be trying to take a leap of faith with you for your money. Some of you could have found out that someone was with you strictly for your money. Could have been an Aries. But you don't want this person. Whoever this is, this person do not want you. Somebody's starting drama from the sidelines. Whoever this Aries is. Tell me about the Six of Swords or Eight of Cups, please. Mm-hmm. Six of Swords, the Eight of Cups. Thank you. The Empress, bitch, didn't I say it? Bitch, they know, they know, you know your motherfucking worth, bitch. You know your worth. You said, I'm going to be patient. I'm going to stack my bag, okay? Yeah, you over here, baby, you focused on the shit that's going to matter. Like I said, you focused on your family. You loving on yourself. Look at her. Bitch in her whole little gold outfit. Bitch looking good. Okay. Bitch out here looking good. Oh, yes. Thank you, spirit. The chariot. Bitch, yes. You move the fuck forward. Some of y'all could be Gemini Cancer Cuspers. Okay. You focused on your motherfucking happiness and you focused on your finances. You're not thinking about love now i feel like with all these pinnacles here and then this motherfucker two of cups came out here spirit getting ready to drop something in your motherfucking lap uh-huh look at this shit here knight of wands but the knight of wands okay so there's a young fire sign that maybe you didn't make a make maybe you didn't make a, a full decision this could be a leo Judgment. Oh, now came out an upright. So you have made a final decision about this person. Somebody, whoever this Leo is, somebody wants to reconcile. Tell me about this Knight of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, please. Knight of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles. Mm, thank you. We have the Magician. So somebody is trying to manifest you. They trying to manifest a reconciliation. They want to come towards you. Whoever this is, this person could owe you some damn money, okay? So yeah, whoever this is, somebody could owe your ass some money. Some of this Queen of Pentacles with this Three of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles. With the Magician. Thank you. Okay, the sun flip. Okay, so bitch, look, you make some motherfucking body happy. Ooh, this king of wands. Wait a minute. So somebody done went from a knight to a king? Okay. So somebody felt like, bitch, they had to step their motherfucking game up. Before they could come to you, they felt like they had to step their motherfucking game up. Okay. Ooh, okay. But somebody out here looking good. So you might have changed the wardrobe or something. Look at this page of wands with this two of cups. So somebody wants to message you. Okay, but you could have their ass blocked. Whoever this is, yeah, and they trying to figure out, they trying to find out what the fuck you got going on with you. <laughs> Baby, we are really all here on our bullshit, okay? 
Oh, shit. Let's see. Give me more about this Knight of Wands. Thank you. Five of Swords. That's this motherfucker. Win, lose, or draw, bitch. He said, look. You walked away from me, okay? But bitch, I got my eye on you. Cause Slim, look at you. You date this motherfucker feel like you they match, okay? Now, you can have a young fire sign and an older fire sign trying to come after you. Bitch, I told you, Jim, you always got that motherfucker bait on the line. This is that motherfucking Aquarius, though, too. That's that Aquarian energy, that five of swords. So you could have this motherfucking Aquarius. Mmm, with the king of pentacles? Wait a minute. So hold on, hold on, bitch. I feel like somebody playing some motherfucking games here, okay? I feel like there could be a king of coins, and they could be using this young, whoever this motherfucking little young thundercat is here. This person could have been coming at you, because look at this. This motherfucker got a little devious little look on his face. He or he up to some shit. Okay, but whoever it is, this motherfucker King of Pentacles is the one putting his ass up to it. Mm-hmm. We're going to clarify that a little bit more. Tell me about this King of Wands and the Sun. The Magician King of Wands and the Sun. This was getting ready to flip in the... So this is somebody who... They don't want, they don't want you to see them as being toxic anymore. Ah... They don't want you to see them as being toxic and backstabbing anymore, okay? This person is keeping a fucking eye on you. They're trying to manifest you back. This could be that motherfucking wizard, that magician, that fucking sage, yeah. So then I say, this motherfucker could have be kind of light-skinned, you know, with reddish little hair. This motherfucker like to drink and shit. Mmm. So this person, somebody sees you as a two of cups, but you got this motherfucker blocked. They're trying to send you a message. Somebody wants to court you. They wants to take you out. They feel like, look, damn it, it's time for us to celebrate. But you done left this motherfucker out in the cold. Why? I feel like you and their beliefs just don't match. You said, look, I'm just going to wait on what the fuck, what, what, what's, what's for me. You and this person, I had some sharp words already before. Okay. And then after that, you chose to focus on you. But now this motherfucker is saying they want a two of cups with you. Why? Because they see you as stable. They see that you can manifest, but there's some bullshit in the wings. Okay. Then we have the emperor right back here. Okay. Tell me about this empress. Give me one. Give me, give me one on the empress. Damn, that's, that's too many spirit. Give me one on the empress, please. Thank you. Seven of Swords. Ooh. So there's an Empress being sneaky. Ooh, bitch, how this flipping up? Because this wasn't like this. Oh. So somebody see this. Some, somebody feel like somebody's being sneaky. So this Empress could look at this Aquarian like this motherfucker up to no good. So you canceled that shit. Look at it. Yeah. Whoever you and this motherfucker stuck, bitch. Did I tell you, baby? This motherfucker over here suffering in silence. That's that motherfucker nine of swords. Look at it. The two of cups in the reverse. We have the star card and we have this. And this is what we have here. The fuck? <laughs> Jim, I love it. Jim, say, bitch, get your sneaky ass out of here. You're a liar. Tell about this seven of swords. Yeah, you don't see a soul connect. You say, uh-uh, I'm good. I feel like you surrendered that shit. You say, uh-uh, baby, I'm okay. I'm going to let you go ahead. Play your little games and shit. Yep, look at you. Mm-hmm. This could be dealing with a Aquarius with Sag, highly aspected. Or a Sag could be involved some type of way. Could be a Sagittarius Empress. Somebody, this is some bullshit. This is some shit. Somebody playing a lot of fucking games, Slim. Yeah. You walked away divine timing. But you did stay in your ground with this situation. Huh. You want for the fool? Palace of Wands. Two of Wands. So somebody needs to take some serious action and, you know, and make a decision. But some of you, this could be about your home. 
You need to take a leap of faith and you need to move away from wherever it is that you're living. That's going to help. That's going to help assist you as well in your transformation. I feel like you need some new energy. Tell me about this sun. Okay. So somebody missed the opportunity with you. I feel like whoever this person is, yeah. They could fear like dealing with their emotions and shit. Give me one for the moon. Mm. Knight of Swords. Ace of Swords. Okay, so yeah, I feel like somebody tried to come at you with a for, with a sexual relationship for some of you. Some of you, I feel like that this is somebody that, you know, they feel like you're quite defensive. They want to make you an offer. They want to offer you this new contract, but they're stuck in their head because they feel like, baby, the wh where you are right now, Jim, they just like, look, yeah. I feel like they know you're out here looking good, feeling good. You got motherfuckers out here fighting over you and shit, trying to be with you. And this motherfucker don't know whether they coming or going. Or this king of coins. Do I want to use another deck? Yeah. Yeah, so we have the seven of... Okay, so you stood your motherfucking ground. You standing your ground on some shit. Ooh. I was itching, baby. Let's see. What deck do I want to use? Second time, Let's get big baby out here. Oh, second big baby. Yeah, see? This king of corn was married to a queen of pentacles. Or they want a higher level of commitment. Oh, no. Something wasn't wish fulfillment. So I feel like, yeah, once you found out this person was married... Talking about this half. Ooh, yes. Could have been married to a Capricorn. But somebody's toxic as hell. This 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 person could be a Capricorn. Tell me about this Knight of Wands, Five of Swords, King of Swords, King of Corn. Knight of Wands, Five of Swords, King of Corn. Yeah. This person feel like this was a missed opportunity. Uh-huh. Ooh, you weren't happy, Jim. Well, Leo wasn't happy. Eight of Wands, five of... I mean, sorry. Eight of Pentacles, five of Wands. So for some of you, there could be some conflict at work. Feel like, yeah, you're bogged down with a lot of responsibilities at work. Or someone feels like you're not going to want to work on this because of all the conflict that took place in this situation. Because see, the devil coming out here in the upright. The devil came out in reverse over here. Tell me more about this king of wands. Well, why did Jim walk away? Let's see about this eight of cups. You was patient. You walked away from the situation because you seen that it was something you saw that you was just like, nah. Like I say, whoever this motherfucker is, I feel like this is somebody that's married. Tell me about the Seven of Swords, Temperance, and the Eight of Cups. The Hermit. This is somebody you ghosted. Somebody has a lot of fucking regrets. Yeah, because you ended this shit. Look at this. Somebody want to make amends, though. Why did Gemini... And what I'm saying is the truth. The Ace of Swords is going to come on. Why did Gemini... Okay, so five of swords again. So, yeah, somebody, baby, they play a lot of fucking mind games, and they just want to win. They don't give a fuck what they got to do to do it. They just want to win. Why are the five of swords here? Why were they playing mind games with John? What is this revenge about? Somebody could have been trying to get revenge, too. Tell me what this revenge about. Why were they playing mind games? Okay, because they're upset because you ended it. So this could be still like, uh, you know, 
For some of you, it could be a wife. For some of you, this is you. You just walked away from this person. Someone did, somebody was lying, being sneaky, deceptive and shit, yeah. Look, this little knight of wands here. This motherfucker tried to come off like they was a king of, you know, a king of pentacles, but this person is immature and childish as fuck. They just jump off fucking cliffs. So this person is the type of person they take all, they take all kinds of risks. Yeah, but somebody's trying to message you, this king of wands, that's heartbroken. Tell me about the king of wands. Well, no, tell me about this five of pentacles. Five of pentacles. Mmm. So somebody feels like that they lost their family. Due to a situation. Tell me about this ace of swords. Why is the ace of swords here? So whatever this truth was, did you find out somebody was manipulating? Somebody could have been doing some sort of sorcery or trickery. Tell me about, yeah. Oh. Yeah. This night of swords keep coming out here, honey. You had some words for this motherfucker. Talking about this tower. Okay, somebody's stuck in their head. Why are they stuck? Like I said, somebody's suffering in silence. They losing sleep at night. They're not understanding what the fuck is going on. Tell me about this nine of swords. Yeah, somebody's stuck. Two of cups. Somebody, look. Somebody played some games with you, Jim. You done took a break from love. You say, look, I'm trying to just go ahead, tame my emotions, keep myself grounded, and, you know, I just want to be single. I feel like you just said, fuck that. I'm just going to wait. You know what I'm saying? And your intuition is telling you, just love on yourself right now. Sit in your power, Okay. And then, you know, it's, it's leaving people heartbroken and feeling left out in the cold. But at the end of the day, line, not, these motherfuckers leave you in confusion, stuck. You know, you got to walk around with the blindfold on, acting like you don't see that these motherfuckers got all kinds of secrets and bullshit going on. And what the fuck I'm saying is the truth. It's not wish fulfillment for you. So, therefore, I feel like you're just focusing on you, your stability, and you're moving away from all of this bullshit. Okay, these motherfucking fly by night ass relationships. You don't want to be bothered with that. That's not what makes you happy. Okay, so you're moving forward in your life. Fast forward motion. And I feel like whoever this is, this is the king of wands who sees you. You know what I'm saying? They could try to, you know, want to come and see you at your house or some shit. But this motherfucker want to communicate how much they care for you. Because this person cares for you a lot. But in divine timing, this person, I feel like they're trying to work on their little money and shit. Somebody could have somebody pregnant or this person wants to just give you some sort of, let you know that they have some sort of crush or emotions for you. But this person could be very emotionally immature. Yeah. Because someone, yeah, you're confused about some shit. Mm-hmm. So you just decided, look, I'm going to rest, take a time out with this shit. I'm not going to sit up here, overwork my brain with it. Yeah. But like I said, whoever this is, you block this motherfucker. So, yeah, I don't feel like you're feeling it at this time, Jim. Yeah, you're not feeling it at this time, Jim. Mm-mm. Like, you out here giving back and forth to folk, but at the same time, like I say, you're not entertaining much of shit right now. see what other messages we have honey baby like I say honey you get this motherfucker butterflies cause they see how you out here baby you ain't taking shit off nobody no more so if you was at one point this motherfucker know you ain't now okay and that's what's making them like you even more you out here paying these motherfuckers absolutely no mind 
No mine. get some other messages my babies let's see what else is going on some eyelid wipes. My mother keeps telling me to buy some. What do I want to do? 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 Let's see here. Let's see what's going on. Want to dead or lie? Then I say, bitch, this motherfucker say one lose a draw. Ah, then I say, this motherfucker wizard. Somebody, bitch, is on your lizard, Medusa. Okay, but the player came out in the reverse. We have the priestess. And we have Achiever. Okay, you're working it out, Jim. Oh, shit, we got the victim here at the bottom. So somebody's feeling like a victim. You could have motherfuckers out here feeling like a victim, Jim. Yeah. All right, give me one more for Loner Wizard. Thank you. Empath. Okay. So whoever this wizard is, they're drawn to you because of your light. You're in, you being you be an empath. Okay, so somebody could have been trying to paint you out as being like this wicked ass person, but at the end of the day, they see your worth, baby. They know you're a motherfucking wallflower. But then at the same time, I do feel like you know, I feel like somebody was trying to put some shit on your name. Yeah, look at this. This motherfucking magician is back. Femi Fatale. This person feels like baby. Okay. We have a Virgo that's a high priestess. And we have goddess here. And we have magician. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see what we can get for this. Matter of fact, do I want to use this deck? Do I want to use? So, yeah, you have somebody that's wanted dead or that wants you dead or alive, bitch. They say, you out here, you a loner, or whoever this person is is a loner. But they see you as an empath. I feel like both of you guys are. Um, but whoever this is, this person is a grand wizard. They're very skilled in the occult, whoever this may be. 
This is somebody who could have married somebody for money. And they're reflecting on it because I feel like for some of them, it may not be any love here. So that's maybe why this person, because whoever that married person was, that may be why this motherfucker was chasing you. But whoever this is got some bad habits. They like this one. They like this one. That sugar bugger. That bugger sugar. Okay. Mm-mm. We ain't doing that over here. We done told you that now. We told you that. Okay. So look. So this person could have had some sort of screenshots or thought you did. But somebody's trying to get the inside scoop on you, baby. They, they, yeah. You got motherfuckers all up in your motherfucking business, Gemini. Look, that chasing came right back out. So this person, I told you, they're drawn to your light. You're an empath, and they know that you are. They know you are a light worker. But this person is a wizard. And they, they keep their identity hidden, whoever this is. Tell me about Medusa and the Wallflower. Okay, wait a minute, girl fight. So somebody could be competing or at odds or some shit. Okay, this is how it came out. No confusion. So confusion. Somebody ain't confused. Somebody. So there could be a fight in Ray Arthur. We're going to find out more about that. Uh-oh. Okay, so somebody. Oh, so the player in reverse. We have a... Uh, Didn't I say? Somebody likes... Some, your light irritates somebody, demons, baby. And there's some motherfucking body that's blocked. Then I say? You block somebody's ass. Whoever this is, this person is not broke. They got some money. They got a coin. Or somebody is looking to see if you broke. And they realize, no, bitch, I got a coin. Okay? Tell me about this priestess and this Virgo. So you got a wizard and a priestess. Ain't this some shit? Oh, wolf in sheep's clothing. So while somebody may be feeling like somebody is a, a weakling, no. Some of you can have Virgo highly aspected. Some of you could be dealing with a Virgo. Okay, give me one more for this. Oh, somebody's crying over you. Oh. Somebody got an STD? Who is it? See, I said I wasn't going, but I felt that damn towel being that fucking STD. I just wasn't trying to focus on that, but it didn't come up, so I wasn't trying to bring it up. You know what I'm saying? Come on, just achiever goddess. Oh, moves in silence. So, honey, this, I don't know. I don't feel like, I'm feeling like these are two separate people. I feel like somebody got a choice to make. Tell me about this moves in silence. Somebody, I feel like, got a choice to make. Yeah, dust it off. Yeah, boss bitch. Yeah, I feel like somebody moving unbothered shit. Unfazed. This is you, bitch. Head in the motherfucking clouds. You ain't think about none of that shit. Oh. So a Virgo could have gave your person an STD. Let me see. We can really see. Wait a minute. What the fuck? Oh. Rejected. Somebody's now curious about you. Interesting. But you're ignoring their ass. Somebody's trying to impersonate you. Jim say, what the fuck else is new? What the fuck else is new? That's too many. Fed up, waiting, child neglect. So somebody could be neglecting it. Somebody is not a good parent. Somebody feel like somebody's not a good parent. Move in silence, dust it off. Yeah, somebody trying to dig up some dirt on you, though. Somebody feels like you're always partying. You could be taking dirty offers. You travel. You know, you can have a lot of groupies. Well, this may be how you're looking at your person, how your person looking at you. Somebody looks at you, though, as an overachiever. They see you as a goddess, though, bitch. How about that? This wolf, this wolf when she's clothing crying over you.
fed up came out again. Karmic friends ghosted. Impersonator. Mm. Definitely Virgo energy that ghosted. That's 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 hermit energy. Okay. Yeah, I ain't even use that though, because we already used it. So I just wanted to get an idea with the hand we can time map. We can make get some messages. Something about this loan or this wizard, this empath. Oh, power couple. Bitch. The witch. Okay. You got a witch and a wizard, bitch. So this person, ba baby. You and this person, people will see y'all as a power couple if y'all are not together right now. Because I feel like this could be somebody that's coming towards... This is this person I feel like that's trying to come towards you. If y'all are not together right now. They see that both of you have an equal exchange of power. Which can make you an unstoppable couple. Okay, then we have the witch here. And see, somebody's missing you. Didn't I tell you? Somebody want to take, make that much... Jump off that motherfucking cliff. They want to jump off into the unknown. They see how powerful and magical you are, and sometimes they wonder if you have them under a love spell. So this person trying to figure out why the fuck they can't stop thinking about your ass. That's what they want to know. Why can I stop thinking about this goddamn girl or this guy? Why? Yeah. Ooh. Tell me about my deuce to this wallflower. Okay. Ooh, betrayal, foolish. Their fleeting heart will only end up betraying you in the end. Your soul deserves better. So for some of you, this could be for my masculine. You know, this wolf in sheep's clothing that came out over this Virgo. Foolish. They feel like a fool for crossing the line and messing up the connection. But to embarrassed to come forward. So somebody knows that they betrayed you. Okay. They do. They know they betrayed you. They know they fucked up. They did some shit they ain't had no fucking business. Yeah, healing. So this person is watching you heal, okay? From dealing with all these fuck, these fuck boys and fuck girls, okay? They're watching you healing. They're at the end of a, or this person is healing. They're at the end of a big healing cycle coming to peace with their past and bringing back balance in the connection. So they want to heal themselves before they come to you. Which is a good idea, brewing up. Be ready to expect the unexpected because something is brewing and it's gaining momentum. So did not say you bitch. Let's see, give me one more for this power couple. Alright, gave me two. Didn't I tell you bitch they trying to give you a damn message with your ass and block their ass? They trying to resurrect this shit. They want to message you and explain everything to you, but they know they have to do right by you. Did I tell you? This motherfucker knows before they can bring their ass back in your direction, they got to get that shit together. Before they going to think they going to resurrect anything, because bitch, this shit clearly is dead, okay? Because when you got to resurrect some shit, baby, that shit in the graveyard. <laughs> you done had a motherfucking memorial service and some more shit for this shit. <laughs> Chum say, look, battle little wizard. Y'all be out here playing chestnut checkers. I'm trying to tell you. They trying to resurrect this shit until both of you learn to let your guards down and be vulnerable. This love will continue to be a battle. So y'all going to always be in this five of wands energy or this five of swords energy. I feel like it's more not because, you know, five of wands is more physical, you know, because it's action. But when it comes to that five of swords, I feel like so you could be, y'all both could be air signs. Like I said, somebody could just have Virgo highly aspected in a chart or somebody could be dealing with a Virgo, but I feel like this is somebody with Virgo highly aspected in a chart. What you thought to be lost forever will come back to you and you'll witness the impossible be made possible. So you keep, Spirit keep telling you this. This person sees you as a witch and you could be temptation. Look, each day gets harder and harder to resist what they know in their heart to be true. They see you as their forbidden fruit. So, 
this could be some 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 taboo shit. What you got going on, Jim? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. What y'all got going on? Who this motherfucker? See, this somebody that you know. Uh-huh. This somebody that you know through somebody who you know through somebody. Okay. So you got somebody on your motherfucking line that ain't supposed to be on your line. In the, in the normal societal world, okay? Hmm. Tell me about this high priestess, this Virgo. Oh, this is too much. Oh, wound. Their unhealed childhood wounds prevent them from forming meaningful and long-lasting relationships. So, the mask. I feel like someone needs to do some serious healing in order for them to really be able to tap into their gifts. Yeah. They want to remove the mask they've been wearing and be brave enough to reveal their true feelings. So someone wants to tell you how they truly feel. They do. This could be a high priest as well. Now, you know, energy is fluid. This is not about man and woman. I mean, I go by the depiction that's on the card, but at the same time, you know, this could be about, you know, this is about feminine and masculine. So you take it how it resonates. I I just want one card. I don't want the whole board covered with cards. I don't have enough space almost as is. Yeah, the journey. This love journey may be long and challenging, but so long as you are with them, they'll never walk alone. Some shit is a... Shit sound like something out of the notebook. And that's one of my favorite movies, but this shit sounds weird. Okay. Yes, the gods favor you. God is taming the beast. You make them putty in your hand. They know their old conquering rays will not work for you. Okay, then we talk about this yesterday. Again, they know they cannot come at you with that old bullshit. Sending you that bullshit, that testing your temperature ass text and shit. You don't hear from them, you know. Y'all have a whole good week or two weeks of a good time and, a, and good bliss and y'all bonding. And then next thing you know, you don't hear from this motherfucker for about a week. Or you get in trying to get in touch with them, they don't answer. That type shit. Yeah. They know they can't come back at you with that shit. So they know they got to do their healing. But they keeping their motherfucking eye out. Somebody keeping their eye open though, though. Yeah. They got a detective on the case. See, my ex is the type. Let me tell you. He ain't going to come ride past my house himself. He got people that'll do that for him, okay? And so, yeah, see, haunted. This is my fucking haunted right now, okay? Yeah. This my this mofo told me when I moved. And I'm like, how you know? I have eyes everywhere. He even knew where I moved to. I moved across town. I said, fuck me, you know. Their vivid dreams haunt them. They dream of how you they broke your heart. And you moving on with someone else. Ooh. So, Jim, they feel like you done moved on. Ooh, passion ignited. Wait a minute. So, hold on, bitch. Your nipples on fire. God damn it, Jim. Your nipples on fire, bitch. <laughs> Woo. Call these suckers. Yes. Wait a minute. Their intense sexual desire towards you is making it hard for them to know the difference between lust and love. So this person, like, okay, they trying to figure out, is this really love? Do I really love Jim? Or am I just lusting after Jim? Energy cords. What the hell? Check. Despite the distance between you, they still feel the energetic cause that is keeping you two connected. So, you and this person energy is all up through each other. All up and through each other. Wishing well. There's a lot of excitement in the air. You awakened a new life in them that has, that has them lost in a field of possibilities. So, yeah, this person is just feeling like... They know you in reach, but they can't reach you. You know that feeling like, you just like, look, it's right there, 
but you can't touch it. You see what I'm saying? Unseen factor. There's more to this love story. Though you cannot see, there's still much to unfold. So, oh, fairy tale, bitch. Wait a minute, Cinderella. They think this is the kind of love that only happens in fairy tale stories because to them, you are too perfect and too, be too perfect to believe it's true. You know, my ex is always telling me that. He was like, the conversation was like, he was like, you just get it. He was like, I've never met a woman who's as, who as, who is as awakened as you. Like, he was the way, the way you look at life. And he was like, what he do love about me, but what I didn't like about him. You see what I'm saying? Like, I'm one of them most people I can apologize and I can admit when I'm wrong. He is not going to do that. And this motherfucker's a Taurus Gemini Cusper, okay? So I'm dealing with a motherfucking bull and twins. I ain't gonna lie, that was my baby, though. <laughs> that was my baby, though. But baby, after nine motherfucking years, honey, I ain't got that kind of time to waste again. I gave two separate motherfuckers damn near a decade apiece. That's 20 years damn near out of my motherfucking life. <laughs> I'm good. They saw and heard something that turned their sense of reality upside down, left them feeling powerless and trapped. So, I feel like exhausted there's a lot of baggage that needs to be taken care of before they approach you they're really trying to trust the situation so it's something that then i say that sacrifice it's some sacrifices and shit that has to be made before this person can come towards you period period has to be some sacrifices and shit made before they can come anywhere near you spirit is not letting it go down give me two Two triggers. Look, light and dark. You have to know the light. You can't know light without darkness. So this is like... <sighs> you need to heal from abuse. So this is like you need to realize that there's going to be obstacles all, you know, in any relationship is what Spirit is saying. But at the same time, Spirit is saying you are not to avoid what you know to be true. You know what I'm saying now? He ain't saying go out here and play no motherfucking fool for nobody. Yeah, where? Stop sweeping it under the rug. You know what the fuck is going on. So stop avoiding it. If you know that this motherfucker is, you know, out here doing foolish shit, you know a motherfucker. Yeah, look at this motherfucker. Got a clown. He a clown. Got these big ass, dumb ass hands. You see what I'm saying? No. Spirit saying no. Exactly. Ritual. Work with your wounds. Some of you are like, if you are a witch, get into doing some candle magic, baby. It's a. Look at this. Cutting cords. Cut cords daily to people and situations that's draining you. Period. But this could as well, you know, firm take back your power, positive self talk. So you could have some sort of, yeah, this person lied before and they'll lie again. So you have a Virgo that's around you, baby, that this motherfucker done lied to you once, they're going to lie again. This could be this motherfucker, like I said, this Virgo came out here. This is about them, you know, they they, they, they keep a lot of secrets. And this motherfucker could have had an STD, this motherfucker could have And I feel like this, you know, because I only took, I was supposed to take two calls for each, each stack. Yeah. I feel like you're getting ready to... Spirit is saying you need to cut the cord with the, whoever this Virgo is. Stop avoiding the fucking truth and move on. Okay? Because all you're doing is keeping yourself stuck in a bunch of fucking illusions. It's the seven of energy. Seven, seven of energy. Seven of cups energy where it's nothing but illusions and confusion. You are tripping. You're tricking yourself. Stop lying to yourself. Trust your intuition. Exactly. You're tricking yourself. So, Spirit is saying, for those of you dealing with a Virgo or Virgo energy, yes. Stop avoiding the truth about this person. I don't know. This person could have some sort of fucking, uh, some sort of root on you or some shit. I don't know. But all I know is spirit saying, look, you need to relax, relate, release that shit. Okay. Relax, relate, release. Relax, relate, release. <laughs> that whole situation. Because if girlfriend out here giving you STDs, my dude. 
Or my chico. You need to move away from that shit. Mentally and emotionally. Okay? Let's see what's going on here. Oh, this power couple, this wizard in this day gone witch here. Yes. Let's try and send this message. Okay, look. They taking their goddamn time. Twin flame. It's the twin flame situation. Okay, so somebody's come out of regret about a situation. Could be the Scorpio. A Scorpio energy that you could have mentally moved away from or that tried to mentally move away from you. Give me one more. Since we know, okay, like I say, but this motherfucker watching. This motherfucker's watching. Okay. And waiting for the right time. They checking their ego and their pride. Because they feel like they come towards you right now. They know it's going to cause too much conflict. But this person wants to offer your ass a pinnacle, honey. A big ass pinnacle. And they hoping you're going to take their offer. About this betrayal, foolish. Sweeping shit under the rug. Mm -hmm. This emperor. Yeah. So you got a big daddy. You got a boss daddy, baby. Ooh. But you meeting their ass. You done turned your back to the motherfucker gym. Oh, you say, bitch. Because you out here on that, on that, on that shit. <laughs> Jim, say like you are we on that shit. Wait a minute, what's this? Hey, Carolyn. Yeah, Jim, say like you out here still on your player shit. But they could have came off like they not. Look at that. Mm hmm. Oh. So, there's some sexual shit here. Somebody want, yeah, baby. Somebody want to burn it down. Burn it down. Okay, <laughs> somebody gonna knock that mess off. <laughs> Woo! They trying to illuminate that thing. They want to make amends. And I feel like they try to do it sexually, Joe, but this motherfucker's lying. Whatever it is. They said deceit. Yeah, somebody juggling. Third party situation. This motherfucker still dealing with somebody. First, say get the fuck on, get in your little Uber boat and keep it the fuck moving. Get in your little Uber boat. Alright, since this is a twin flame situation, we're gonna use the twin flame deck. Now y'all like this bitch got a deck for everything, yeah. Cause see, look at this. This motherfucking devil again. Where you go? No, King of Wands in the reverse. This somebody mad, bitch. Cause the Queen of Swords, I mean the Queen of Wands can Ooh. Cannot be trusted. Whoever the fuck this damn fire sign is, but y'all mirroring each other. How you, so hold on. This got to be a karmic lesson of some sort. It got to be. Because this is a twin flame journey. With that four wands, definitely twin flame. Okay? 11-11. But they're saying this motherfucker ain't to be trusted. Okay, we're going to leave you right there because I want to know what the fuck wrong with you. What are they spying on? Oh, this page of swords. Thank you. Oh, this could have been you who found out that this person had a whole little situation going on. Mm-hmm. Give me one more. This ten of pentacles here. Thank you. Baby, the ancestors speak. Ooh, the lovers. So hold on, bitch. Ghosting. Okay. So somebody got the fuck on and left somebody stuck because somebody ain't get no closure. Somebody just cut this shit all the way off. 
And you ain't had no motherfucking regrets. And this you jump, you had no regrets. How about ghosting this motherfucker here? Ten of Pentacles, the lovers. Oh, so y'all not mirroring. Interesting. But you, this King of Wands, you and this person were mirroring each other. Ghosting, Six of Pentacles. Wishing. Didn't I say this Six of Cups suffering in silence? Seven of Swords, Infidelity, Spy, Deception, Lies. So somebody either had two dudes or somebody had two chicas. Okay. Tell me about this Emperor and the Queen of Cups. Oh. So this Emperor trying to clean some shit up. Mm-hmm. Yeah, cutting karmic ties. So, this person is dealing with a karmic. Whomever this person is here, this emperor here, they're dealing with a karmic. Let's see what's going on with these motherfuckers. Okay. Yeah, so this person feels like they like getting under your skin. Give me one more for the comment. Okay, reverse. I suffocate your divine masculine. So whoever this is, this person my like, bitch, I'm not. There's a hidden agenda here, though. Didn't I say somebody playing some motherfucking games? Didn't I say that? I don't care about the karmic. I'm only using her. You don't want this motherfucker, Jim. Secrets, exactly. The fuck? Oop. I'm abusive and toxic, bitch, clearly. What the hell? Baby. Let's get through this right quick so I can get, we gonna find out about this motherfucking karma. Well, the Queen of Swords, Six of Wands, just clean up. I mean, the Knight of Wands. Oh, that's a Six of Wands. Knight of Wands. Thank you. Yeah, the second Seven of Swords still here. The Star. Six of Swords. So, I feel like you cut whoever this person out because this person came up to you, I feel, I feel like... Acting like they are, you know, an emperor. But whole time, this motherfucker's not an emperor, baby. This motherfucker indulged in third-party situations. Somebody caught an STD in a third-party situation. What the fuck is going on? Yeah. Somebody caught an STD in a third-party situation. King of Swords. I don't know if the motherfucker had a threesome. Okay. Oh. So, see, somebody now don't realize, yeah, this high priestess here again. So, you look beyond what the fuck you saw, and you got rid of this motherfucker here. Mm-hmm, you had to reevaluate some shit. Because I feel like this person kept you in a lot of internal conflict, and they kept you waiting and shit. And you like, look, while they was off with somebody else. Oh, that right, this Virgo, because it's the Queen of Pentacles that popped up again. Talking about this king of cups. This person want to conquer you though. Because they feel that you're... Yeah, they know you'll catch. <laughs> Undecided. Too many variables. So that to me, that's my seven of cups. So somebody is... Undecided. Talking about this ten of swords. Queen of swords. Ooh. <laughs> so, you done set some motherfucking boundaries, Jim. Queen of Swords, that's you, baby, all day long. You're not falling in love easily. 
you focused on your independence at this time. You're growing, you're happy, and you know that if you kept putting your motherfucking life on hold, bitch, you're going to be staying out there in that motherfucking grave, y'all, honey, with nothing but bones. And your little nightgown. We can't add you out there in the dirty nightgown, uh, Jim. We can't do that. And Page of Cups. Yeah, happy surprises, love, visit, a uh, messages. So somebody, like I say, this could be, I don't know, for some of you, it could be a young water sign. Yeah, but you don't already set some motherfucking boundaries with this motherfucker here. Okay, whoever this is, you don't set some boundaries. But this Ace of Wands, Three of Pentacles in the reverse. So, look, you ain't got time for no sexual contracts. Jump and I say, bitch, I'm awakened. Okay, motherfuckers, that's awakened. Don't do sexual contracts. We don't do that. Yeah, internal conflict. But I don't feel like this is you. I feel like you're embracing the light right now, Jim. I really do. Let's see. We're going to see. One for this eternal conflict. Hmm. Forbidden came in the reverse. So now it's in the reverse. So I feel like somebody done got a different perspective on something. Ace of Pentacles. Divinely got it. Okay. Look, the Emperor. So somebody's been ooh, Ace of Swords. Somebody is being guided towards you. Like there's new love that's waiting for you. There's a divine masculine. That I feel like wants to be honest with you about something. They want to come towards you and they want to give you some sort of clarity and honesty about a situation. Um, they want to have a steady union with you. I don't know. Some of you guys have some sort of like diamond, crystal, or stone. It's a big stone. Honey, it could be a diamond ring, bitch. Spirit is just saying right now, trust in the connection. I know, Jim, you don't want to hear that shit. Look, get a new perspective, okay? Didn't I say somebody wants to take your ass out on a date? But you may walk away from this person with this Eight of Cups energy. You may walk away and decide to just move off on your own. Why? Because you feel like whoever this bitch is, she's still around. That's what you're still trying to feel. Yeah, see? Waiting. Lessons. So you and your person are in separation. There was no balance in this relationship, you know, and I feel like that was the downfall of it. You knew it wasn't balanced, okay? But we can right see right quick what the fuck is going on with this. Uh... Now, tell me about this can't be trusted. Uh... Oh, you big baby. Uh huh. You can't trust that this person is one. Whoever this fire sign is, somebody's mad because you're not taking their offer. Or you broke up with them. Something about this King of Wands reverse cannot be trusted. King of Cups reverse. Ooh. This is a. Who is this crazy? That's just, this got to be that motherfucking wizard. Then we got the King of Pentacles, though, in the upright. So I feel like this is a little crazy ass fucking Capricorn, but we can raise really see why they can't be trusted, Spirit. Why they can't be trusted? Why can't this person be trusted? Okay, so pretty much the lovers came out cross. Cause this oh, the Seven of Swords was just peeking up. Yes, it was. Why is the lovers in the reverse? Okay, somebody's going to be getting breadcrumbed here. Oh, I hate when I get a bump on my forehead. That shit hurt. Uh, yeah, somebody's going to try to come and make amends with you, but they're not trying to... Whoever this is is not going to be trying to give you no fidelity, okay? This is not about love. This is... Uh, Six of Pentacles. Okay. This King of Pentacles. 
Queen of Cups. They see that you are loving on your fucking self. They do. This person wants you to act like you don't know something. Why is the King of Wands reversed? Oh, this person mad because you turned your back on their ass. You just said, I'm waiting on some other shit. Fuck that. Why are you turning your back on them? Yeah, you moving forward. But why did you turn your back on this person? Okay. Person I in a third party. Judgment. Tell me about the King of Cups reverse. Ooh. So this King of Cups in the reverse. You cut this person out. Why did Jim cut this person out? Ooh, a tower. Mother's tower. Queen of Pentacles. <sighs> Big old fight. What was this fight about? Okay. Someone making someone an offer, but fuck, it's a page offer though. What is page of pinnacle? Whoever this Virgo is, I feel like this person wants to. Uh... Okay, so somebody's trying to act like everything is fine. Like they want to, like they don't really want to mend a situation, but they do. Somebody want their family, want their family back. And they want to start a new cycle. But this person already done stabbed you in your back before, okay? This already, this is somebody that you're in a family situation with. You may not be married to this person, but you and this person have been together for a long time. Y'all have children. Y'all have things that you all have acquired together. Yeah. But you done had a fucking aha moment and you like, eh, uh, nah, you took the blinders off, baby. <laughs> you say, nah, I took the blinders off, baby. Uh-uh. I see everything for what the fuck it is. I'm healing myself. Somebody's trying to keep faith and hope, though, that you'll see that, that you'll see that they can make you happy. The hermit, this Virgo again, or this is somebody who, you know, ghosted you. Seven of Swords. Five of Wands. Where's well, the Seven of Swords? Five of Wands here. Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. So I feel like you all could have been um, arguing and fighting this person. Somebody could have stole some money from someone. Someone, I feel like this person feels like, you know, this person, they're not abundant. They don't grow, you know, things, money and things don't grow when they're with this person. Yeah. Somebody said a lot of hard shit. Somebody's put the burden down. So I feel like somebody do want to communicate, but somebody like, look, I already know this is not wish fulfillment. I don't want it. I want to go off somewhere else and start somewhere else. And I feel like that, look, with these sixes, I feel like that's what this person is trying to do. But we got this king of wands in the reverse again. So this motherfucker is really upset. And this person, I feel like they like, look, I just want to go do what the fuck I want to do. I don't want to be in a relationship. Yeah. This person still, though, is kind of crossed about whether they want to really release the past. Queen of Cups. They're thinking about this king, this Queen of Cups, which I feel like this could possibly be you. Because, like I said, you've been loving on yourself, Jim. That's all you've been focused on. Yeah, but I feel like you don't want to <laughs> you don't want to contract with them. God damn. King of Swords. Ace of Pentacles. So yeah. Whoever this is, somebody's not putting in any effort in the situation. I feel like whoever this is, this person just wants to. Uh. So yeah, like I said, Jen. Oh. If somebody might want to marry you, but I don't want to make them want to marry me. 
I hate she's a Gemini when that song comes on. I be ready to just slip my own fucking wrist. I swear to God, I be so mad. Uh, oh, he came out in the upright for you, bitch. Page of Cups, yeah, somebody's very emotional. So somebody all about the passion and action, but when it comes to maturity, baby, that shit is not there. Okay, but you done block some shit. <laughs> Jim, you done block some shit. Yeah, Jim say, look, I need to see what else is out here, babe. Because there'd be too much confusion and shit going on with you and your motherfucking baby mama. I don't know why it's a little, little baby mama. But I do, I feel like this is somebody, they have a child with this person, whomever this person is. Somebody got a child with somebody, and they keep going back and forth, back and forth. The shit, they never get a fucking victory out of this situation, but I feel like whoever this is, this motherfucker won't leave. They won't leave. You got a sash that feels like they was unsuccessful with you as well. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Someone does not see this person as a... Uh, they don't see anything wrong with this person. You had a nine of pentacles come out in the reverse. You had the empress come out in the reverse. Whatever this is, they feel like this they're just nothing grows with this person. Let's see. We're gonna get one card for that and then we out of here with this this spread. I wanna do that can do our karmic spread right quick and see what the fuck going on with this karmic bitch, cause it's a lot going on. Empress Queen of Cups. Look, the hermit, that Virgo. Yeah, whoever this is, baby, yeah, and this motherfucking Virgo is stuck. Thank you. Nine of Cups. Why? Because this person, somebody else, they feel like whoever this is, somebody else is wish fulfillment for their person. But this person wants to make amends. This person wants to make amends. Because they have regrets. But not seeing how much they really love you. So this was a child's, yeah, like I said, the Empress in the reverse. You could have a child with this person, but well, y'all could have got a divorce, whatever the case may be, okay? Y'all both could be very nice, good-looking people. You know what I'm saying? Y'all, you know... Make a nice little couple or whatever, but at the end of the damn day, it's like, it's just not working out. Yeah, it's ended. You're done. You're done. Some of you, you wanted to be single. Look, bitch, you say I'm victorious. But I feel like Spirit is saying, okay, so what direction you can right go into now? Because I feel like whatever direction you went into, you could have gone to some toxic ass person. Could be dealing with another toxic ass Gemini. I don't know what the fuck is going on. What I'm saying is the truth. Okay, you and this person could have had words. Y'all could have left each other out in the cold. But this is someone that you have a lot of emotions and feelings for. Now, you want to communicate to this person. You want to take them out. You want to, I feel like... You want to start a new contract. You want to work together. You want to do something. Could be start a business with this person or something. But this person, if you are stuck in a self-imposed prison, yeah, look at this. The King of Cups. I mean, the Queen of Cups. So you the King of Cups, and, you know, this person is the Queen of Cups. That's why I said whoever this Queen of Cups was, that's who this person have emotions for. That's who this person wants to go towards. Okay. Talking about this devil and the lovers. Five of swords. 
So an Aquarius. So some that could be an Aquarius that's obsessed with you. Like this motherfucker's obsessed. They are mad because you you chose a whole nother path. Yeah, you ain't in your motherfucking feelings, Jim. The three of swords came out in the reverse. Jim, I ain't heard about shit. Okay, and I feel like this person is stuck, full of regrets. Yeah, because now they know how much they care about you. They do. You look at this person as being hella toxic, though. Yeah, and you felt like you needed a break from the situation. How they stay yelling and all kinds of foolishness outside. Ace of Swords. Page of Wands. So, yeah, somebody wants to communicate with you, Jim, but they can't because you blocked their ass. And this is someone from your past. This emperor. You see, okay. This motherfucker ready to show up is what you need now. I know you don't want to hear this shit. I know you don't. Because I ain't going to lie to you. I don't want to hear it. Because I don't know why. But I've been having this real fucking nagging ass feeling that mine is getting ready to try to fucking resurface. I don't. I get it. I get it, I get it, I get it. But I can only go by what, it's, what, what, I'm, in, what, what I'm in seeing. What, 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 yeah. Two of Cups reversed, didn't I say? This person wants to communicate to you that that situation is over. And that's what they want to tell you. That that shit is over. Yes. But they're trying to be patient. They're being patient in this situation. King of Coins. But they feel like you're getting ready to be over here on your bullshit, okay? You're going to be over here on your bullshit. Some of y'all can have leave in your chart. What are they being patient about? Okay, wait a minute. They don't know how to come towards you, how to approach you. How to present you with this offer. How you're going to take a situation. Um, so I feel like they're trying to scope out the scene right now. Yeah. But this King of Cups, honey. This motherfucker looks upset. High Priestess. Yeah, they know you are. They know you are. Somebody knows that some somebody knows about a secret too that some of something that happened at your house. Well, it could be with a young water sign. I don't know. For some of you, that's for someone. Then I say some sort of secret or something. The moon came out. And then we had the Ten of Wands right behind here. Whatever this information is, it's a burden. What is this high priestess in the moon? So this person could be doing something at night. Uh, King of Wands. What about this King of Cups and King of Wands? Queen of Cups. Ooh. What I'm saying is the truth. There's something going on. Yeah, whoever this, this motherfucker stuck. Whatever this is, is haunting them. What about this King of Cups, High Priestess, the Moon, King of Wands, and the Queen of Cups, please? Okay, that's a lot. Oh. Okay. Someone wants to have sex with you, bitch. They do. But they feel like you done blocked that shit. They like, look, Gemini ain't trying to give him that point I want to see what the fuck going on with this right here. Somebody's in, somebody's fearful that you know a secret. Some of this King of Cups and the King of Wands. Three of Wands in the reverse. I feel like you're like, it's like you're no, it's like you're not waiting, but you're waiting. 
to see if somebody gonna take a leap of faith and you know do equal give and take the wheel so divine timing like I said somebody's calling themselves waiting for the perfect time yeah so somebody's not moving right now because I feel like they like look division already done walked out on me left me in the motherfucking cold yeah look at this king of souls baby you be having these motherfuckers out here on your line Jim I swear on God you do why is the hangman here The hermit. Interesting. Somebody you ghosted. Uh oh. This person's gonna wanna cut your ass. So oh, bitch, I ain't fight you. Wait a minute. What the fuck you do, Jeff? <laughs> this motherfucker feel like he wanna cut you out and fight your ass. Jim, you can't be out here playing with people's emotions. All right, we at 130. Let me get this. Uh, I said I wanted to do the comic messages, and then you know we gotta do. The uh, gotta do the advice, yeah, honey. But use your intuition, stop acting like you don't see certain shit because it is there, okay? It's there. Like I say though, somebody wants to make you an offer, baby, that you can't receive. Whatever this is, they feel like they not forbidden. They might have been at one point in time. Don't know. I mean, I know. I don't know. I think I'm going give, to give Big Baby a rest right quick. I got a card somewhere where it don't belong. Let me see. Time. That's why with me, I don't like uh, putting too many cards out because my ass always end up. Uh, hold on, let me see. No. Put it in here. There's a card missing. 
I know how many I have. So one, two, three, four. Oh no, they all here good. Okay. Goody, goody, goody. Goody, goody. Okay, let me find out somebody in one of them little situations like uh what was his little name? His little funny looking self. Lorenz Tate helped him out in that damn movie, baby. Cause honey. When they showed the real pictures, so I said, wait a minute. When y'all bitches out here getting the I said, see, that's what I'm talking about. When the motherfuckers don't know they whistle don't know they were. Okay. Oh fuck goody goody. What the hell? And y'all got this nigga out here playing y'all out, y'all in court battling and shit. Got wrinkles and ain't no motherfucking body get shit. At the end of the day, well, you know the last one did, but you know what I'm saying. The last one did. Uh-oh. Come for me. Oh shit, bitch. That bitch showed you come for a bitch. Who is this crazy nut bellow bitch that they got on their hand? Somebody got them a nut ball. My higher self is begging me. Hold on, but this shit dark. My higher self is begging me to leave the karmic, right? I create negative energy. Definitely. Hater, I love I love to cause you guys trouble. I'm broken inside. No, tell me something I don't know, bitch. Like, let's see. Yeah, my high self is begging me to leave the comic, but ain't gonna, but ain't gonna know it. Y'all been trying to belch all day. Believe it or not, my higher self is begging me. To leave the comment. Oh, really? Oh, this bitch got a lot to say. See, yeah. It Sex kitten night worker. He's not my man either. Financial problems, instability, strapped for cash. Family members have opinions about your connection and the reversal. I feel like don't nobody give a fuck about this shit. They probably tired of hearing this shit. I feel like I am. Shit. I don't even know you. Lack of faith. I create negative energy. So, whoever this is, this person, they have no faith in themselves nor the connection any fucking way. Child support increase or deduction. So, somebody done, somebody ass just got hit for child support, okay? Somebody just got hit for that bag. You're not the person you were last year. You won't be the person you are next year. You are now next year. Intriguing. You're mysterious. There's something that he likes. You don't know what we've been through in the reverse. Oh, you know all about they shit. You just like, look, I ain't got time. <laughs> okay. Loyal, dedicated, taking a risk. Okay. So somebody's going to be like I said, baby. I have a sex. I have a I have a sex. I have receipts. Email, text, and photos. So... Whoever this person is, darling. Yeah, baby, you clearly are broken inside. Black magic love spell, low vibration fear of letting go. So somebody could be under a love spell. We saw that Virgo is a high priestess, honey. So somebody is under a fucking love spell, insecure tactic. They do shit to keep this motherfucker feeling insecure. Look at that, it came right back out. So, yeah, whoever this is, somebody needs constant validation and all this other shit. Feeling invisible, unhappy, misunderstood, jealous, envious, state of being, feeling or being jealous. I fake the pregnancy to keep them around. Drunken, indulgent, bar-hopping, groupie. Wow. 
Options and choices, more than one. I'm sure you have options too. He's not the only one in your life. Hmm. So somebody feel like you out here living the Vida Loca, Jim. We have devil energy, dark energy, bad intentions. Beware, protect yourselves. History. I know you two have history. So somebody didn't say somebody know. That's what I say. You don't know what we've been through. Oh no, bitch, they know about you. They know about you. They know about you. Okay. I'm going to keep these three because I want to know what the fuck that's about. Alright. Let's, 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 let's get it. I'm broken inside. Yeah, drunken indulgence. You got to be. You out here getting drunk, bar hopping, and being a groupie. Just jumping on niggas. Okay, can't be doing that out here, Jim. We can't be doing that. Like I say, it may not be you, boo. I'm just saying. This could be whoever this damn, uh, whoever this feminine is you messing with. Like I say, I don't know. I hope it ain't you. So I'm not just sex kidding. He's not my man. He's the financial problems and family members in the reverse. Having an opinion in the reverse. Let's see what's going on, what's going on, what's going on, what's going on. Yep, look at this. Somebody selfish, moody, childish, petty. Then the motherfucker say I created a negative energy background check. Somebody did a background check on you, baby. Somebody could have found out oh, this is uh, your person's karmic that they dealing with. For those of you who your person could be dealing with a karmic, Argumentative, never wrong, party girl. So somebody feels like, I don't know, Jim, this could be him. I hope I ain't got no sex kittens up on here. Who working at night? <laughs> Wait a minute, who's working at night? See, nightlife groupie, who is this? Commitment forever, masquerade games. Somebody wears a mask, okay? So I feel like... <laughs> Oh, shit, Jim, I hope this ain't you. Oh, okay, wait a minute, marriage counselor. So, this is somebody who's married. What about this intriguing? Toxic family and friends, okay? Somebody got some toxic friends. Ooh, divorce. Oh, to celebrate my ding, 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 divorce. It's like, no. I don't think that's funny. Oh, so somebody divorced left their ass broke, baby. Somebody low on fucking funds after this divorce, baby. Some, some, yeah. So I feel like, motherfucker, you went from a 2021 down to a 2001, okay? God damn, bitch, you even took your car. What type of shit is this? This bitch left you with pocket change. You got $36. Yes, look, see, somebody need a job. Oh, There's some gossiping and talking going on. Oh, see, somebody got more than one karmic. See, there's options and choices, more than one. I'm sure you have options too. He's not the only one in your life. Yeah, somebody got more than one karmic they dealing with. Baby. Yeah, somebody out here comparing some shit. Who call us the best and all this old other shit. Child, uh, divine feminine blocked on social media so you blocked this motherfucker here whoever this motherfucker was who had more than one karmic they sent up there thinking they about to compare your car to the next bitch car and all this old ever little wild ass geek and shit yeah look the other woman karmic so this motherfucker chose a karmic over you bitch and they about to have to deal with this bitch and reap what they sow. Yes, ma'am. Some of y'all could be, you know, married. Mm-hmm. Look at this. Look at this. But it wanted to come out in the reverse. Talking about this background check party girl. Background check party girl. Two of cups reverse. So... 
I feel like a part of this is could be because someone likes to go out and party. Someone could like to go out and party. And somebody doesn't like this. Yeah. They're not, to, I don't feel like they may not have expressed it to you. Uh-huh. Look at this. The lovers. This is you, Jim. Somebody don't like that you like the party. Tell me about the, Oh, yeah. The situation dead. Situation is dead. Could be this fucking Scorpio. Could be a Pisces as well. Ooh. Five of Swords. The Devil. With the Hermit. Yeah, you ghosted this motherfucker. Look at this, yeah. This is a Capricorn or some fucking body, baby. You said, I said, la vista, baby. I'm looking for a new love, baby. A new love. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Jeff. Oh, shit. Hold on. Ooh, okay. Empress. So, yeah, this wife say, bitch, it's commitment forever. Forever, ever. Forever, ever. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes, whoever this empress is, this bitch is negative. Page of cups, okay. Could have a young water sign child or this person just very immature when it comes to emotions. This person could not like to, you know, express their emotions. Tell me about this. Empress in the page of cups. Somebody could have got pregnant by somebody. I don't know. What the fuck? Oh, somebody let this burden go. Ooh, okay. Somebody was a burden. Somebody's watching. Why was this person a burden? Why did Jim let this... Or why did this empress let this burden go? Oh, they ended this shit. Time to put it into that cycle. And you did just that, Jim. Let's see here. Who was this? How to celebrate my ding, 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 divorce. Yeah, something left somebody high and dry. Four cups. Somebody missed the opportunity. Ooh, strength in the reverse. So I feel like somebody at this point feel like they don't even have the strength, baby, to try to start a new relationship. Mm-hmm. Somebody feeling backstabbed and betrayed. They say they ain't got it in them. But somebody getting ready to try to find their happiness, even through the betrayal and the backstabbing and the feeling kind of, you know. Feeling some melancholy kind of energy. Yeah. Somebody drinking to cope with their emotions. Somebody need to get a fucking job, though. Okay, and they not listening to their fucking intuition. Somebody that came out to this motherfucker ain't got no job. Could be a Leo. Sun, five of wands. Okay. Oh, shit. Somebody out here fighting over penis. The hell? Well, this penis called some sort of fight. <laughs> Wait a minute. See, somebody had a side piece, okay? Somebody had a side piece, baby. And yeah, uh, there was a decision. I feel like there was a court decision, okay? With the justice being here. And this is a moral decision, okay? So this King of Cups can be looking at you like, 
you walked away because you wanted to just go out there and be free and shit. You might be, you? Yeah, you chose to walk through a door. You might have started a new contract with somebody, took a leap of faith with some motherfucking body that was from your past, and the shit ended you in heartbreak. Feel like you chose the wrong door for some of y'all. Or oh, somebody else did. Somebody chose the wrong option. Hangman. Ten of Pentacles. Divine Feminine. Some of this devil and this more than one karmic. Six of Cups, yeah. Somebody from the past. Four Wands, Palace of Coins. So for some of you, I can feel like, oof. You could have been in a toxic kind of relationship. Yeah, look at this judgment here. Like you remembering good times from the past but at the same time it's like at some point at that time you had to make a judgment call yeah wow okay so something was delayed until someone came out of conflict a new start a new cycle was delayed till some conflict was over Look at this third party situation, three of cups, but at the same time, too, somebody wants to reconcile with their family. The full reverse, five of wands reverse. Thank you. Yeah, you need to love on yourself first. Before you can start any new contract, you need to clear your thoughts and you need to love on yourself first and focus on you and you. You know, your money and with the things that you want to do. Yeah. You have some regrets. Oh, it's a Scorpio that do. Oh. They feel bad because you're not communicating with this person. And they are stuck in their head, baby. Well, this is you. I don't know. Yeah. Someone wants to... Someone wants you to make moves towards them. Spirit saying you gonna do the right thing, or you gonna you want you gonna go back to that bullshit, the karmic bullshit. So Spirit waiting on you to make a decision on something. Yeah, look at this three of cups again. Page of coins. I feel like though I don't feel like you wanna mend things with this person. Somebody, okay. Whoever this is, if somebody want to love up on you and they waiting to talk to you, it could be this goddamn Aquarius. You block this motherfucker, though. This motherfucker like dealing with karmics. So this person ain't learned their fucking lesson yet. But this person trying to find out some more information about what's going on with you and your family life and your money and all this other other shit. Niggas, from what I see over here, you need to be focused on your own motherfucking bag. Don't be worrying about what the fuck Jim got in their, in their damn bank account. Somebody need to be focused on their little, they little pockets. Because, like I said, there's some lint in there. Mm-hmm. There's some lint. Yes, we ain't do bad on Simon. We ain't do bad on Simon. Y'all know y'all want really for real, for real. So I don't forget to why I was a bug, you know what I'm saying? I can't leave my babies out there like that. You know what I'm saying? Can't leave my babies out there like that. I just can't. Y'all don't know. Somebody be out here messing with prostitutes. Leave that motherfucker alone. <laughs> I'm sorry. Mm-mm. That's not sexy. I don't hear messing with prostitutes and shit. See how that motherfucker could come back with an STD. The 
We're gonna get some tea tree messages. I hate when I do that. Oh shit. But you could have seen some lipstick stains. That motherfucker was bold enough to come to your house with some lipstick stains, bitch. Yeah, I got class. I gotta do my class work tonight. I hope my son ain't in my bed, because he about to get his ass up. He says he's gonna take a nap now. My child loves to take over my damn room and my space. He just do. Oh yeah. Um, uh, put my crystal back over here. Y'all yeah, been slipping on my pimp and I've been forgetting to charge up my decks with my crystals. So next moon, next full moon, I gotta be somewhere where I can do it. The hermit in the reverse. So, ooh. So somebody feels like you will get they want you to come out of the hat and gym. Let's see. Alright. Ooh, the lovers in the Queen of Swords, bitch. Hold on, y'all energy is on 1,000, bitch. Queen of Pentacles. Three of Swords. Ten of Swords. So, Jim, I feel like for some of you, y'all need to slow down on the party. You know, shit, that might have been for me. I already told you, I made my conscious decision as a Friday, baby. I ain't doing no parties down here. I have one of my friends. I'm going to his party. Other than that, it's a fucking no-go, okay? And I got a two-hour meeting with my boss tomorrow. Oh, my God. Some conflict going the fuck on. Let me see. Oh, think about it. About a family breaking up. Somebody just ain't happy no more in a family situation. Let's see. Let's get a tea tree message for the advice. Oh, shoot. For the outcome. Let's see. I don't know. I say a lot of people only use half the deck. Okay, so we have Valley. Deep personal strength and peace that assures success. We have Chain. Chain of events that will affect your life. Broom, new home, new attitude. Did not say for some of you, somebody get a new home. Vine, seek out information that will help you. We have the axe, forces worth working against you. Huh. So there's a chain of events that could be getting ready to take place. September. So some of us will be moving in September. Look, yes, I'm trying to be dead right up here. Clue myself on that. Well, be careful. Do not take risks. Okay. Hmm, that's interesting. Say, so be careful. Don't take any risks. All right, I'm gonna use my butterfly dick. A butterfly dick. Valley vine. Valley vine, please. Valley vine. We have, you are stronger than you know. Keep the faith. Mm. 
take the next step now. So it's something that you're procrastinating on, Jim, or that's holding you stagnant, and you need to cut it out. Ooh, and it's blocking your it's blocking your finances. Somebody could be doing some sort of magic. Because when they say forces, that's some sort of energy. Healing from the past. Some of you are not doing the healing that needs to be done. And we have motivation, religion, and spirituality. Mm. Damn, hit the two, two hour mark. I wasn't trying to do it, but that's okay. Two for Valley and Vine, please. Keep the faith. You're stronger than you know. I only need two, baby. How about this? We're going to put you over here. <laughs> okay? Because that was just you, you doing too much just right there. And I'm being moved to just move on. Uh-uh. My bad, bitch's deck ain't been one to talk. I'm gonna see, I'm gonna take, take her out and then charge her up, see what happened. But she ain't been one to talk for a minute. I was gonna try to use her earlier. See, look, look, the star. <sighs> so there's a situation. One more. There could be an Aquarius that wants to come towards you with some sort of offer. But this person taking a fucking sweet time. They moving slow. And one more for the starter. Mm, yeah. Not gonna happen. Jim say not gonna happen. Chain of events that will affect your life. Forces working against you. So it's something that you need to either cut out or something that's somebody or something trying to cut you out could be dealing with a sag king of cups in the reverse Ooh. somebody waiting somebody's trying to give you all kinds of illusions somebody is playing with you like i feel like somebody's really doing some sort of magic or something this is a husband or like yeah, this person is in a family already, but whoever this motherfucker is, this motherfucker ain't got no nothing but time on his motherfucking hands if he just sitting around fucking with you. Okay? Um, I feel like come September, like I say, some of you will have a new home, new attitude. Yeah. Page of Swords. Because someone I feel like is watching your home now to have priests, and I feel like you feel like you feel it. You feel this shit. Yeah, you ready to walk away from a situation. Something's going to come out. Something's going to happen. Yeah, this king of swords here. That's full of fucking regret. Because now you don't block that motherfucking offer. And you don't block their ass, period. You feel like this motherfucker ain't worth your time. They're very immature. They act like a child. And they toxic as fuck. Yeah, mm-mm. You know with this offer comes bullshit. Look at them lurking. The hell they got nothing out here. Why Jim don't want to move forward? The yeah, spirits say don't move forward with this situation. It's going to be a lot of bullshit, conflict with this motherfucking Aquarius here. Give me one for this King of Cups reverse the Temperance and the Three of Wands. Three of Cups. Okay. Whoever this water sign is, this motherfucker's upset because your ass don't want to be in a motherfucking third party situation. This person is manipulating some shit. So, be careful. Because the thing of it is, I feel like, yeah, this person trying to block your abundance. I don't know. We're going to have to see what the next step is. 
Yeah, you missed the opportunity, but you don't care. Something is getting ready to come to you or happen in September. Something can be dealing with this Virgo. Hang man in the reverse. Yeah, you had an aha moment. Somebody made a bad investment. So somebody may make a bad investment in September. Hmm. So this could be something that you may need to walk away from. But remember that Seven of Cups came out like it was some sort of illusion. Like it's something. I know so bad investment let's see here so I'm about why is take the next steps now here two of cups page of pentacles king of pentacles so this is about you mending a connection What needs to be cut out? This Virgo. I feel like somebody is going to be enlightened that they want to be with you. Whoever this is, this person, they know that you are wish fulfillment for them. Whoever this Leo is may be the problem. What is the problem? What is this forces working against Jen? What are the forces working against Jen? Six of Swords. Ace of Wands. Ah. So someone in the gym could be just really trying to get you in a third party situation. This person don't have any love for you. They're just trying to manipulate you because they want to have sex with you. And that's why Spirit is saying whatever this is, it'll change the course of your life. If you make the wrong fucking decision, it can change the course of your life. There is a earth sign that wants to come towards you. That could possibly want some sort of higher level of commitment with you. I feel like this person could be wanting to, yeah, look at this, something shady. Jim, just say fuck it. Just all the damn offers. Leave these motherfuckers alone. But that said the little queen of, uh, that said the king of wands. Oh, I could be still talking about that fire sign. Yeah, this motherfucker, you're talking about this ace of wands. Give me one. One. Quick communication, yeah. Because this person wants to say, yeah. Whoever this was, they told you what's what they wanted. This person stuck. And they holding on to some shit. What's taking place September? Some of you will be moving in September into a new place. Oh, conflict. The lovers. Eight of Cups. Huh. So there may be some sort of conflict that may take place in September. Or with this Virgo. So some of you, you may be moving away from whoever this Virgo is in the month of September. And I feel like, what are they... Yeah, to go be single and be with this queen of cups. But you undecided about something and why? Let's see why. Oh, so you scared that you don't know whether this person, you may want them to move in with you, but you're scared to go that way. Yeah, look, the ace of swords came out as soon as I said that. So somebody going to want you to move in with them, Jim. They may ask you in September. And this is whoever this person is that you was dealing with this person. I feel like this was an on again, off again type of relationship. You and this person was dealing with each other for a good little minute. And uh, y'all been in separation for a good little minute. 
but um yeah this person i feel like wants to come and ask you to move in with them and this could happen in september but spirit is saying whatever this is a chain of events that will affect your life so something is getting ready to go on don't know what i mean we got a little insight but you know spirit likes to leave an element of surprise okay Yeah, see, you said be careful. Do not take risks. So whoever that motherfucker fire sign is that's trying to get you in this third party bullshit and you you think you about to just go and have sex with this person and all this whole other shit and you already know this motherfucker in a commitment because you can't say you didn't know because I told you. Okay? So, yeah. Spirit say, don't take no risks that's going to fuck your life up. Let us say, choose wisely. With that two of wands, it's like, you know, Pick what door you going through. Pick the right door. Because you fuck up and pick that wrong door, baby. I, I, you. Honey, the consequences could be dire. Because what's going to end up happening? You go do that shit. You seen windfall came in the reverse. It's going to block your fucking abundance. That's going to be your karma. Your money, your, your finances, all that shit is going to be blocked. So. That's what I have here, my gems. Love you guys. See you guys in the next week. Peace.